Hey, what's up guys? Mr. Free Coiner is coming back to you again. I hope you guys are doing well and taking care of yourselves. Um, just wanted to make a quick video here. Not sure how quick it will be, but um, definitely uh, just wanted to share some things with you guys. Uh, what I'm seeing, what I've heard, and all of that good stuff. So, um, <clears throat> okay, so just to start off, as we see here, uh, the whole market is back down. XRP is, you know, back in a very viable state. You know, it's one way to look at it. Glass half full, glass half empty. Depends on what type of person you are. Obviously, uh, most of us do want to see uh, moon time, but I kind of feel like we're a little ways off from that. Uh, it's very possible we could see some um, pretty promising uh, things at some point, but unfortunately, uh, considering everything going on, uh, we're probably a little ways from that. Now, the thing that I find kind of shocking is the fact that everything is down. We're talking crypto, the stock market, uh, gold and silver. I mean, pretty much everything is is down rather than going up, considering uh, we have this whole other global worldwide issue called COVID-19 going on, uh, or not necessarily called COVID-19. I think that's the actual condition it causes. But either way, um, it seems a little strange to me. But guys, uh, from what I have heard, uh, this is for a purpose. Now, some of the things that are going on, again, this is just what has been shared with me, uh, is that the gold-backed -back dollar equivalent is uh, waiting in the wings, uh, or either that, or it's being used kind of in the background. Now, we're not going to hear anything about that, or we're not going to use that until some of these other things get flushed out. Um, we're going to go through some pain. Uh, I think uh, one of the things that I heard is uh, what's being planned is to soften the um, uh, economic crash, right? So it won't be a like a full-fledged, you know, really uh, devastating situation, but uh, they're trying to minimize the effects it will have on us. Uh, that's, again, just something I heard because, um, you know, the people that are in control, whether whatever you want to call them, the cabal, the elite, or whatever, um, they, guys, unfortunately, they have full control over this. Um, we only know what we see, right? There are, I'm sure, plenty of meetings that happen in the dark, and uh, they are planning out what they shall do with us. Now, uh, also, we know that the QFS, or the quantum financial system, is in full effect. It is being used as we speak. Um, the uh, GCR, or Global Currency Reset, is at hand. Uh, so, all of these things are working right now. And I personally believe, and I've heard this uh, from a few people, that this whole situation that we're dealing with uh, with this COVID, it is merely a distraction uh, while all of this stuff is being done in the background. Now, how true that is, I don't know. Uh, I think some folks really more so want to believe the narrative that is uh, being given to us. Me personally, I never believe the narrative, um, especially if that narrative is being uh, piped out over the mainstream media without stop, right? If it doesn't cease, which is what we're seeing, you can never really believe what is being uh, shared by the mainstream media, typically. Okay, that's just what I've learned. Now, uh, and, and I'm not saying that it isn't happening, right? But uh, somewhere in there, there is, uh, I'll say, some deception, okay? Uh, we also have the stock market that has... Uh, fully lost everything, guys. I mean, it is just uh, not everything, but it is, it's down quite a bit. Let me see here. We go over here. We can see uh, where we are with the stock market. The Dow is down uh, quite a lot. I mean, we were, I think, over 
30, uh, 30,000 at one point. It is now down to 25,000. Uh, and, you know, it looks like it's come back up a little bit. But um, I think we're going to see even uh, lower lows as far as that goes. Uh, again, a lot of this stuff has to happen uh, to kind of usher in um, what is coming. Uh, coming. Uh, so some other things that I've heard is that the new financial system is uh, is again it's just waiting in the wings to be implemented, right? To so they can switch us over uh, to that. Uh, to you know why that is, I'm sure uh, there are a lot of there's a lot of speculation on why, but uh, nevertheless it is happening. Uh, but again, my whole uh, I guess question is how is it that everything is down? Uh, we got, like I said, we got gold. Look, gold is down 55%. Um, and guys, uh, something else I heard is that gold and silver is going to drop even further. Uh, the possibility that we're looking at tens of percentage points uh, that gold and silver is going to go down. Uh, there's, again, I mean, I don't, I don't want to just say uh, too much, uh, but just suffice it to say, that we haven't seen the end of this. It is going to get much worse, even with crypto. Um, and how long that will be, I have no idea. Uh, it it could be a quick process. Uh, it could be a, a long, drawn-out process. Uh, I mean, as far as I know, we could be in this situation until 2022. Um, or it could be uh, by summer. That it's all over with. I have no idea. Uh, time frames just never work out because there's so many things happening in the world that you know things that need to happen. Uh, for example, we do have the U.S. signing a peace deal with the Taliban. Okay, how will that affect the world stage? I have no idea. Uh, all of this, it, it all works for the same purpose, right? It, it, everything that's happening is all pointed towards the same thing. And I can say this, although, uh, you know, I am not one to be very much into politics and, you know, siding with this one or that one, but if I had to choose a side, I would definitely side with Trump, okay? And not so much uh, with the man himself, but with what I am seeing that he's working towards, okay? Um, it, it really aligns more with uh, some things that I am good with, as opposed to what some of the things that are happening, happening or that the Democrats are trying to do. Uh, now, again, I am not about that whole left-right paradigm. It is, you know, I know better than that. It's just uh, there's really no other way to kind of describe it. Um, so when you look at what, uh, we'll say, the Dems are trying to do, uh, that's it's more restriction, loss of liberty, you know, things like that. But it seems to me that uh, the you know Trump himself. I mean, I'm not going to say the Republicans, uh, but Trump himself is actually uh, or his, his folks. And and I've heard say of uh, the 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 uh, Patriots, as it's been talked about, they are all um, uh, trying to move us into a better situation. So hopefully, here in the near future, um, we will definitely see some better things uh, for us you know just just overall just some better things happening um, now going into some other things uh, Trump calls uh, this criticism that he's having over this uh, virus and whatever uh, the Dems new hoax um, and uh, some articles are actually spinning this to say that he's calling the uh, the whole situation a hoax uh, but again, I mean, we all we know we all know about spin and how that works, and you know I'm sure he's smarter than that. Now, again, guys, I am not necessarily a fan of uh, you know the whole situation with Trump and the, all that, but it's just again the the direction that they're going. Um, I like that direction. That's that's you know kind of what I want to uh, uh, kind of hit home there. Let's see what else we got. CEOs quitting in record numbers could signal total uh, stock market collapse. So, um, 
Yes, again, guys, the stock market is dying. All right, and again, this is something that has to happen. The dollar is, the dollar as we know it, is going away. Okay, everything is pointing in that direction. Just be ready. Okay, just be ready, guys. Um, we are hedged in crypto, and we, you know, don't fall for any crap that's being put out there. Crypto is a very, very good uh, hedge against everything that's happening. Also, physical gold and silver. Okay, um, if you can do all you can. Uh, from what I understand, now again, this is stuff that I have looked at and people that have much more uh, understanding about these things than me. Again, I am not a, an, an advisor at all. I am just sharing my thoughts and opinions and uh, things that I'm doing and, and what I believe. And again, I personally am staying far away from the stock market uh, at this point. Now, there is going to be a point that I feel uh, would be a good time to buy, but right now is not that time. I think we're going to come back. We're going to pull back on that quite far, uh, just like with crypto. I think we're going to pull back quite a bit. I mean, I wouldn't be surprised if, uh, for example, XRP hits, you know, somewhere around 15 cents. I, I wouldn't be surprised with that. Uh, we have a lot more pain coming, guys. We, we just do. And that's just, you know, uh, from what I believe and what it, the things that I've heard, I totally believe that. And again, uh, with the QFS happening, guys, uh, so the QFS is up and running and it settles anywhere in the world, right? Any uh, transactions settle within or maybe uh, within 32 seconds, okay? Now, we already know, this has been talked about by several different U YouTubers, I'm just reminding you, this is using XRP. The QFS uses XRP. So, um, and somewhere in here as well, uh, we have the whole uh, mix up with gold as well. I think the, the dollar, that is the gold backed dollar, is, well, it's absolutely going to run on the QFS, uh, but also, it's going to be heavily tied with XRP. Okay. Um, also, another thing that I came across was um, Ripple actually having 450 plus customers. Okay. That was apparently showing on their website. Uh, however, they recently changed it back to 300 plus. Okay. Um, so, you know, again, that deception, that, that misdirection, all of that. And guys, believe me, Ripple is in on it too. Don't think that they would not at all uh, have any hand in the manipulation, the things that are happening. Okay. Now, nefariously, are they doing it? I can't say that. Uh, but at the very least, I believe they are being directed to do it by the powers that be. Okay. Uh, so... You know, it is what it is. There's not a whole lot we can do about it. Uh, well, there is something we can do about it. However, I think uh, the majority of us, us just regular folks out there, uh, the majority of us want to believe the narrative. It's safer, right? It's it's uh, less confusing, right? Um, so most people don't want to go against uh, the hand that feeds them, I guess. Uh, or at least the hand that they think feeds them, even though it is in our best interest to come together and, you know, cause some, or not cause, but do some things, like make some changes. It's in our best interest to do that. However, most people do not want to deal with that. And and it's totally and completely understandable. Uh, you know, I would not fault someone with a family, you know, children and all of that. Uh, for not wanting to get involved with it, that type of thing. I, I you know, I can't uh, fault them. If it, you know, we grow up believing the things that we believe, and there isn't a whole lot uh, we, you know, really be able to fall back on. That would be new territory. So, again, that's just, uh, you know, a part of the world, right? Um, so beyond that, guys, that's really all I uh, I have. There's some other things I would like to talk about. However, uh, I'm just, you know, going to forego 
uh, all of that and just uh, just say thank you for you know thank you guys for joining me I know it's been a while since I've made a video uh, just you know, some of the things that have been happening uh, you know and things that are really out of my control I mean you know sometimes I make a video I might get you know 2,500 3,000 views or sometimes it's only seven eight hundred uh, why that is I have no you know uh, proof on what it is I know what I think it is it's you know these algorithms and the fact that YouTube does not present the video to to all my subscribers I, I feel as though I should have at least 3,000 views per video okay uh, it makes no sense <laughs> to for me to you know have over 6,000 subscribers and only uh, get like 700 views I just to me it makes no sense Right. Um, and the fact that and, and I'm not complaining uh, uh, about, you know, the channel doing what it's doing. Right. Uh, you know, some people say, well, you don't make enough video. Well, believe me. Uh, yes, I have made plenty of videos. I was uh, at a time when uh, there was a time when I was making at least two videos a day, sometimes three. And uh, it just and, and when I did that, uh, I got less views. OK. And it is what it is. I know that sometimes I talk about some things that, you know, these algorithms, I'll say, uh, you know, kind of hone in on. And that's okay. Um, so, you know, it's something that I'm willing to uh, deal with. Um, it just uh, doesn't uh, motivate me necessarily to uh, make the number of videos on that level uh, any anymore. So, Anyway, enough of that, uh, guys. Again, if you have not done so already, uh, go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you feel that it is uh, something you want to do. Uh, also, hit the like button. That definitely helps as well, uh, I think. you know. Um, and also, make sure you've uh, pressed that uh, post notification button. Make sure you, when you, when you do click it, it's going to give you some options. Just make sure you hit that. Uh, notify on I guess every upload or, or something to that effect with that being said guys this has been Mr. Free Coiner take care of yourselves and God bless